the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. So for today's video, we are going to help this noob level one reach second C with Spike Fruit. This is the new fruit from the latest update of King Legacy. But before that, guys, to show your support, you can use star code Gamer Nom when purchasing your Robux. So are you ready, guys? First, we need to eat this terrible tasting fruit. Gamer Nom, I know you're gonna do the chicken quest, etc. No. For the first time, guys, we're not gonna do the chicken quest. Why? Because this fruit is so good in grinding. For the first four stats, put it in the power fruit. Let's go to the quest giver. No, not this one. So this one, the level zero. There you go. Kill six soldiers. Okay, this is the first time. <laughs> on almost all of my videos. So first up, we have the Spike Missile. Okay. There you go. You see that, guys? So fast, right? You need to defeat 6, and that's 1 level up. Okay? But if you aim properly, you can defeat 4. See that, guys? 4 at 1 skill. The cooldown is so fast, and when you reach level 10, you can now move to the Clown Pirates. So that fast, right? Faster than the Chicken Quest. So here, you can attack 4, but you cannot one-hit them, so use your spike missile twice there you go and when you reach level 13 you can now unlock your second skill 50 power fruit is the requirement there you go second skill is the spike rush but this is a short range skill the good thing with this is while using it hold it and you can move i'm gonna show it to you again first skill to lure them and next skill see the guys i can still move there you go Okay, so now the goal here is to reach level 20. Again guys, level 20. There you go. And you can start defeating Smokey. You need to put like 4 on the defense to increase your HP because there are times that you can get hit by Smokey. For example, this one. See that? If you have 0 death, you will die immediately. But you can still defeat Smokey without getting hit. There you go, that's the range. The goal here is to reach level 30. Okay. Gamer Nom. I have a problem. I cannot find the quest giver of Tashi. Guys, he is here in this wall. See that? <laughs> okay. So just keep grinding here. At level 30, you've already unlocked your third skill. This skill is so strong as long as you use it properly. The wrong way to use it is this. You're pointing your uh, cursor or your mouse, mouse pointer on the enemy. See that? Two hits. If you want to maximize the damage, you should at least hit your enemies using your spike slash. 5 to 6 hits. See that? I haven't mastered it yet. I'm gonna show it to you later. 3 hits, it's dead. That's how strong it is. Gamer Nom, why do you have that fruit? Guys, someone gave it to me. Because maybe I'm using a bacon and I'm training in Tashi. So, thank you. Because I'm still a noob. At level 50, you can now go to Pirate Island. You can start defeating, again, the Clown Pirates. Defeat 5. So, this is very easy. Z skill. And after that, you can use your Spike Rush or your Spike Slash. I suggest the Spike Rush because it's easier to aim. There you go. But if you're gonna defeat single targets, just like the next mob, the Clown, Spike Slash is so OP. I'm telling you guys. At this point, I haven't mastered it yet. But don't worry, I'm gonna show it to you later. But here you go. When you reach 75, now is the time to defeat the Clown. Guys, by this time, you can use Spike Slash once to burst him. But I haven't mastered it yet. Well, anyway, you're gonna level up here until you reach level 100. And by that time, you've already unlocked your Spike Ball. If you're going to run short distance, this is better than running. And it also damages your enemy. Everything, everyone or every enemy that it passes by will be damaged. So at level 100, you can now go to the Soldier Island. Don't forget to buy your Soru for 50,000 belly. And after that, you can start defeating... Oh, don't forget to save here. <laughs> After that, you can start defeating the commander. You need to defeat 6, so how do you do it fast? Use your Z skill, X skill, or your V skill. Spike ball to travel faster, right? So lure them, there you go, and you can use your Z skill. See that? You can also use your Soru to teleport to the other batch of the commanders, and it's done. Okay, so you need to level up here until you reach level 120. Again, guys, 120. There you go. So when you reach level 120, you can now start defeating the Captain. There you go, the Captain. Actually guys, he's easy to defeat. Z skill, X skill, etc. But if you mastered your Spike Slash, you can one-hit him. 
See guys, by this time I haven't mastered it yet. Three hits only. Four hits, there you go, getting better. So when you reach level 145, you can start defeating the Axe Hand. Guys, to make this faster, Axe Hand, then after that, go to the Captain, Axe Hand, Captain. This is how you do it. C skill, right? Jump. Okay, there you go, get the quest. Use your C skill. C skill. There you go. Because the technique is to aim lower. Don't aim at the mob, aim lower. But again, I discovered it when I was in, I think, Bubble Island, something like that. <laughs> Okay, so when you reach level 200, you can now go to the Shark Island. 200! Again, we skip one quest. We're gonna go straight to the Karate Fishman. One C skill is enough. See that? See that, guys? That's it. The five hit. You're gonna do this until you reach level 230. And after that, you can start defeating the Shark Man. Okay, six hits. Okay, that's the strongest damage that you can do with the Spike Slash. But guys, check this out. Leveling up in this part, the Sharkman is so fast. This is not fast forwarded, okay? C skill, okay? Get the quest. See the cooldown? It's so fast. And then the spawn is so fast. So I suggest you level up here until you reach level 350. As I'm planning to reach 400 here, but we will be skipping the chef ship. So yeah, 350. There you go, guys. 350, so fast. Stat check, 50 defense, 300 melee, and 750 power fruit. We have 300 extra points. Why? Because in chef ship, you need to jump, right? To get the quests. So let's check it first. If we need another 300 points for melee to increase our jump, right? But spoiler alert, no. We won't be needing extra melee. So here we go. We're gonna start with the weapon man. There you go. Just keep on killing him. And after that, go to the black leg. Okay, after defeating the weapon man, black leg, use your C skill. And go back to the weapon man after defeating the black leg, and that's how you're gonna do it. Okay, Marnom, what is the goal level here? You're gonna level up here until you reach level 400 or 450, guys. To be honest, I kind of regretted this. I should have went to this island when I reached level 450, but here you go. You're gonna start with the snow soldiers, Z skill, another Z skill. There you go, and you can use your X skill to defeat them all. Oh, I think this is kind of good, but again, I, su I suggest you stay in the chef ship until you reach level 450. There you go. So goal here is to reach level 450, okay? Again, lure them, use your X or Spike Crush to defeat them, and after that, you can start defeating the King of Snow. Okay, King of Snow. You can defeat him by just using one Spike Slash. Again, aim lower. There you go. See that? I'm starting to master the Spike Slash. There you go, okay. So the goal here is to reach level 500, and after that, you can start defeating the Heavy Man with just one C skill again. See that? One C skill, and after that, you can use your V skill to go to the King of Snow, and after that, V skill to go to the Heavy Man, and so on and so forth. So the goal here is to reach level 625, and after that, go to Sky Island. Don't worry, we have enough Jump, Power, and Soru. There you go. So you're gonna buy your observation hockey for 1.5 million press y to use it and we're not gonna train here you need to go to the desert island first so here we're gonna start defeating the bomb man again just use one c skill to defeat him or you can use your z and x skill okay is there a faster way gamer no yes when you defeat the bomb man you can go straight to the candle man okay and then next up bomb man you're gonna do this until you reach level 725, and after that, you can start defeating the King of Sand. Check this out, guys. Just one C skill, and it's good. See that? The damage of this C skill is so strong, I'm telling you guys. So how to make it faster? Defeat the King of Sand, and after that, Bump Man. After that, go to the King of Sand. And after that, go to the Bump Man until you reach level 800. Oh. That Quake user is really destroying my timing. <laughs> well, anyway, guys, when you reach level 800, next target is Sky Island. There you go. And you, you're gonna start grinding with the Sky Soldiers. You only need to defeat four. So use your Z skill to lure three. And now you can use your X skill to defeat them and your C skill. Okay? Goal here is to reach level 850. So this is a short grind in this area. Again, 850. And when you reach 850, you can now go up in the upper yard to defeat the ball man. Guys, in this part, the grind here is so fast. Again, use your Z or X skill, but I suggest you use your Spike Slash. This is how it will go. Okay, get the quest. Spike Slash. 
then get the quest. Okay. Before the cooldown, the enemy will spawn. There you go. Use your spike slash. So see that guys? It's very fast leveling up here. So you're gonna do this until you reach level 900. Okay? 900. Just 50 level ups. There you go. When you reach level 900, you can start defeating the Rumble Man. Guys, don't forget to turn on your Observation Rocky to dodge some of the skills. But guys, one hit. Okay. After that, go to the Ball Man. Defeat him using your C skill. There you go. And now go to the Rumble Man. You're gonna do this until you reach level 1051. Okay, 1051. And after that, you can now proceed to the Bubble Island. So, Bubble Island is where you can buy your Buso Haki. I'm gonna buy it because I've been reading comments that why are you not buying it, etc. So, here you go. I'm gonna buy it, guys. <laughs> so, in this island, you're gonna start by defeating five soldiers. So how do you defeat them? Use your Z skill. Okay, use your C skill. Use your X skill. Gamer Nom, why are you not luring them? Because for me, it's kind of slower. You need to defeat five. Use your C skill. Okay, so the goal here is to reach level 1100 and after that you can start defeating the leader. 1C skill for the leader guys. 1C skill. Boom. And to make things faster, while it hasn't spawned yet, you can start defeating again the soldiers. There you go. And after you defeat the soldiers, go back to the leader. Okay? That's how you grind faster. And when you reach level 1151, you can start defeating the pasta. Pacifista. But in this game, pasta, there you go. This mob spawns really, really fast. So the level up here is no problem. And our goal is to reach level 1325. Yes, guys, 1325. And after that, we're gonna go to the lobby island. Here, we're gonna defeat the wolf and the giraffe simultaneously. Check this out, guys. I kinda mastered the spike slash by this point. So you need to aim under it. If you see the green line, the HP bar, check this out. Guys, one hit, okay? You can one hit Wolf and Giraffe until you reach level 1400. And guys, Leo, you can also one hit him. See that? So guys, for an uncommon fruit, the Spike Fruit, the damage is really, really high, right? For the Spike Slash. So the goal here is to reach level 1500. And after that, go to the War Island. Use your Soru to go on this area if you have like a low melee. Talk to the traveler, he will ask you to find the map. After that, you need to go to the fish land. Defeat any mob you want here, but again, I suggest you defeat the, this one. The seasoned fishman, and when you get the map, there you go, I'm gonna show it to you. This is what it looks like. After that, you just need to go to, back to the traveler in the war island, and after that, give it to him, and now you're good to go. Just go back to the starting island. Talk to the elite pirate and he will send you to the second scene. So that's it guys for this video. Again, to all the supporters, viewers, commenters, I really appreciate you all. I will be grinding now to get more candies and unlock all the accessories and sword, okay? So see you guys on my next video. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. This is GamerNom. Enjoy this update. And see you on my next video. Bye-bye.